is AKH. Before moving on to the top 10 Dubai police supercars, I would request all of you to please press the subscribe button and also to click on the notification button. That is the small bell shaped button next to the subscribe button for notification whenever I upload a new video so that you would never miss any of my videos in the future. I would also request all of you to please smash the like button to 20 likes to see more of these stuff in this channel. And I would also like all of you to please comment in the comment section as on what you want to see in the next video that will be rolling out soon in the near future every Saturday at 4 pm of GMT plus 0300. Dubai was once a simple lesser that no one knew in the world. However, with the exposure of oil, the nature bloomed and flourished enormously. Besides the world's tallest star, various seven-star hotels and man-made islands, the Dubai police force also has an extravagant armada of supercars that now patrols on the streets of Dubai. The Dubai police force is a 15,000 strong police force for the city of Dubai in the United Arab Emirates. Dubai police cars are very famous around the world. People love to see all the big and most expensive car brands in a police convoy. Now, counting down from the bottom to all the way up to the jaw-dropping squad of cars, we have at number 10 a Nissan GTR, nicknamed Godzilla. The GTR is a sensual sports car. Nissan GTR is considered as a high-performance sports car. The venerable GTR is a hand-built twin-turbo V6 giving out 545 horsepower and producing a top speed of 196 miles per hour or 313.8 km per hour. And it does 0 to 60 in just 3 seconds, making it one of the quickest cars in the fleet. It is approximated to be around 100,000 US dollars. Now, moving on to the ninth position, we have a BMW M6. The BMW M6 is capable of producing 560 horsepower, that is harnessed from a 4 liter engine, producing a top speed of 187 miles per hour or 250 kilometers per hour and it does 0 to 60 in 3.9 seconds. The estimated cost of a BMW M6 is to be around 125,000 US dollars. Now moving on to the 8th position we have an Audi R8. The Audi R8 is an exotic sports car. This mid-engine two-seater sports car originally derived from the Audi R18 diesel hybrid e-tron quattro engine. Compared to its V8 models, the R8's V10 performance is enhanced to another level. With its 525 horsepower mid-mounted engine, the R8 does 0 to 60 in only 3.9 seconds. And also, it runs to its top speed of 196.4 miles per hour or 316 km per hour in no time. The approximated cost is estimated to be around 125,000 US dollar. Now moving on to the 7th position, we have the BMW i8. The BMW i8 is being the latest addition to the Dubai police cars. With its mid-mountain three-cylinder engine connected to two electric motors generating 357 horsepower. The i8 goes from 0 to 60 in just 4.2 seconds on its way to an electronically limited top speed of 160 miles per hour or 250 kilometers per hour in just the time required to open and close your eyelids. The approximate cost seems to be around 140,000 
US dollars. Now, moving on to number six, we have the Bentley Continental GT. This splendid British based supercar can produce up to 600 feet per lbps of torque and 625 horsepower from a 4 liter V8 engine and hence producing a top speed of 205 miles per hour or 330 kilometers per hour and it also does 0 to 60 in 4.7 seconds its value is estimated to be around 235,000 US dollars. Now, moving on to the fifth position, we have the Mercedes Benz SLS AMG. The Mercedes Benz SLS AMG is a gullwing inspired luxury car with over 550 horsepower, has entirely milked from a 6.3 liter V8 engine taking the car from 0 to 60 in just 3.6 seconds with a top speed of 195 miles per hour or 315.4 kilometers per hour making it a beast that any car would love to ride. The rough cost to own one of these Mercedes-Benz SLS AMG is approximated to be around 250,000 US dollars. Now, moving on to the fourth position, we have the Ferrari FF. Unlike most of supercars in Dubai's police fleet, the FF is a four-seater. It may have a status as one of the most polarizing looking Ferraris built in recent years of its existence. But the all-wheel drive 6.3-liter V12-powered car neutralizes all such thoughts that runs in one's mind. As is monster, the 0 to 16 just 3.7 seconds, and its top speed is a blistering 208 miles per hour or 335 kilometers per hour. That happens to be just enough to cause goosebumps to a normal human. This extraordinary Ferrari is intended to be about 300,000 US dollars only. Now, Moving on to the third position, we have the Lamborghini Aventador. Few automakers can rival Lamborghini's reputation for building the world's most extreme road cars and its all-wheel drive Aventador in specific. This Lamborghini then happens to be the brother of Lamborghini Murcielago. It is powered by a 700 horsepower mid-mounted V12 engine. This Aventador can go from 0 to 60 in just 3 seconds and it has a top speed of 217 miles per hour or 349 kilometers per hour. Even lined up against other supercars in the Dubai fleet, the Aventador is simply one of the most insane cars ever to serve on the right side of the thin blue line. The estimated cost of processing one of these Lamborghini Aventador is 400,000 US dollars. Now moving on to the second position, we have the Aston Martin 1 of 77. The Aston Martin has long been famous for building some of the best Grand Tourers in the world. But the 1 of 77 is a different kind of beast altogether. Built as an ultra limited run of 77 cars with a price of around 1.5 million US dollars. The 1 of 77 is a carbon fiber bodied supercar with a top speed of 220 miles per hour or 354 kilometers per hour and it does 0 to 60 in just 3.5 seconds. This beast 1 of 77 is powered by a naturally aspirated 7.3 liter V12 engine that generates to a total of 750 horsepower. Now moving on to the first position 
we have the Bugatti Veyron. The Veyron is one of the most recognizable cars in the world and it's unquestionably the top dog in the Dubai fleet. The Bugatti happens to be the most expensive out of the entire fleet as of now unless and until they plan on adding a Koenigsegg or something that is even more expensive. The Bugatti Veyron 16.4 Grand Sport one of the fastest open top production sports car with an unbelievable speed of 254.08 miles per hour of 408.89 kilometers per hour. The 8 liter 16 cylinder engine boasts a whopping 1200 horsepower allowing it to reach 0 to 60 in just 2.5 seconds. The estimated cost of owning a Bugatti Veyron is to be around 1.5 million US dollars. So with this, I would request all of you to comment in the comment section below on which was your favorite car from my list of top 10 Dubai Polish supercars. As of me, my favorite car from the list was the Lamborghini Aventador. Next week, I will be doing another video at the same time. So I request all of you to please stay tuned and don't miss out any of the videos that will be rolling out in the near future. So with this, I would like to wish you all a very hearty goodbye until next week when I will be releasing the next video.